Risque here and welcome back to Life is Strange True Colors. Um, so last we left off, we... what did we do? We just kind of mourned Gabe's death, I guess, and read a bunch of stuff about how people felt about him and all of that, and then we came over to the dispensary to talk to Charlotte, and uh, basically the mining company gave her an affidavit to where if she doesn't uh, press charges then they'll pay her, so... I told her to go ahead and take the money because I think that's what Gabe would have wanted. He would have wanted them to be set. And he didn't seem like a really, like, vengeful person. So I don't think he would have wanted her to press charges. So, anyway. Let's jump back into it. We still need to vi visit, visit, I can talk, I promise, um, Steph at the record store. And then we need to try and go find Mac, unfortunately. I really appreciate you stopping by. She said it's not betrayal. Still makes me feel sick. Same. But Gabe would understand. Yup. I'm gonna figure out why Max lying. Okay. Glass pipes are so cool. They're like works of art that can also get you high. I love this rainbow bong. Probably cost more than my bus ticket. Also love the alien bong. I want both. Sweet logo. Bet Charlotte designed it herself. Can I buy one? That'd be cool. I really love Charlotte's style. Ooh. That's dope. I love that. There's something you don't see in Portland. Right? What's this? That's creepy. That's very creepy. In the Dominican, they're said to house the spirits of gods. Mostly, I just like how it looks. Okay, that's it's fair. It's really cool. God, put some clothes on. Mary Jane Magazine. Try this new growing trick for big voluptuous nugs. High and dry. How to tell if you're buying water waterlogged weed. How long does THC really stay in your system? Which vape is right for you? Check out this buyer's guide. Oh, Put wait, some I just read that. On. It's the newsletter. It blows my mind that Charlotte's been running the dispensary this whole time. I couldn't even leave the apartment. Haven Springs, uh, Silver Dragon newsletter. Hi, everyone. As you may have heard, someone very close to me has recently passed away. The last few days have been very hard on me and Ethan, but we're doing our best to keep our heads up. So many of you have reached out with kind words, and that has meant the world. I cannot thank you enough for your support. I'll try to open the store for a few hours every afternoon, but things will probably be a little sporadic for the next few weeks. Sorry for any inconvenience, and thank you in advance for your patience. Your friendly neighborhood bud tender, Charlotte. Aww. Respect. When did you start needing a PhD to smoke pot? <laughs> okay, strainless, sativa, blue foria, strong euphoric sativa to stimulate creativity. I want to try that. Stairway to heaven, a blissful mellow high, smoke with munchies. Oof, I need to avoid that because I have munchies sober, so I don't, I don't need to make it worse. And then indica, purple sublime, a relaxing indica delivering full body relaxation while taking the edge off the mind. Sandman, a high CBD strain to relax the body and mind alike. See, I like indica when I'm trying to get a body high, but most of the time I'm wanting to like still be able to function. So indica usually makes me way too sleepy. What about you? Are you, who, what do you prefer? Are you more of a sativa or an indica person? I tend to go for hybrids just cause you know, you get the best of both worlds. Anyway, hybrids, Etheria, a sativa heavy hybrid to restore a balance of focus and bliss. So I want to try that too. Intergalactic vibe, an indica heavy hybrid that blends euphoria and relaxation. Okay. Stairway to Haven. Believe it or not, Gabe named that one. I believe it. Oh, I believe it. 100%. What's on the bulletin I board? I totally paint that. I just don't want to. Fair. Mountain Walker, renderings by Charlotte Harmon. Please join us at 8.30 p.m. on Saturday, March 3rd at the Paradox Galaxy for an exhibit of collected art and works. Refreshments provided. These are my kind of discounts. Same. I dig that. A little steep. But can you really put a price on a kid's dreams? That looks really fucking cool. Nice contribution, Gabe. Aw. Okay. 
and he did it all with one rusty saw and a bottle of gin. Impressive. Havens brings to Historical Society, Qual Feather San Sanatorium. Okay. Built in 1919, the Qual Father Sanatorium operated successfully until its closing in 1927. Under the guidance of Dr. Martin Kellogg, over 500 influenza and tuberculosis patients were treated and cured. Whoop. Ooh, I want a hookah. wonder what it's like to have, I do my drugs out of a glass sculpture type of money. I used to have that type of money. It was pretty damn nice. I'm not going to lie. Okay. I'm out. I wish I'd bought a hookah back then, but um, unfortunately, weed was not legal in Oklahoma at, at all. Not even medicinally, so that was not in the cards. I mean, technically, you still could have bought a hookah, but I wanted one that actually would have gotten me high, so <laughs> it just didn't work out. And then I remember Mosey had a pipe, and uh, one of the guys we bitched about before in our videos broke it and said he was going to replace it and then never did so there's that still need to check the flower shop for mac what's going on over there that looks it's sketchy fine. i love being on hold i love this song me in my head all the time. <laughs> oh, it's that guy's sister. I feel so bad for her. Getting sick of Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. I'm going to. I just want to look around first. God Steph damn, asked Alex. Me to pop by the record store oh my god. Time. Am I not allowed to explore? Damn. I was thinking earlier, though, how awkward it must be, like, when I have to stop and read people's emotions for, like, these people to be watching Alex just, like, stop right next to them and just stare at them. It must be so awkward. Especially for, like, that couple. Well, the guy asking the girl out, that would have been super awkward. Steph asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. I'll find her helpful be back in five or ten maybe 15 yeah that's me another issue of legendary monster hunter th yes time to pay a visit to an old friend snap or should i say an old enemy you don't belong here monster slayer i'm not leaving here till i get answers you won't be leaving at all no where is the sky sword fine i'll tell you the sword was last seen in the city of Camarus, right? Oh, Carnir Carnarus. Carnarus, but it's infested with were spiders. Oh no, I don't like that. All who quest for that sword lose something dear to them. But I'm destined to save the realm with the Sky Sword. Good thing you won't be questing alone. I'll win. Okay. Nice. Looks like Steph might be working on a new project. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. Aww. It's hard to the breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. Ninth Warden's cool, but not as cool as Thanor. Okay. Cool. Ah, there's Steph. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like the one you and Gabe were going to take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. I need your help though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Ooh. That's hard. Uh, let's do Stormwrither. 
Stormrather looks like a worthy opponent. He gets my vote. <laughs> All right, then. Oh, I got to get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. So my brother just died and you're already putting me to work. Okay. Gotcha. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Fill in your character, the bard. Name, race, class, abilities, distortion, field, or healing serenade. Oh, I like both. I'd probably do the healing serenade. I like to heal. Yes, I'm in. Let's start with my name. The Spring Festival is just around the Um, well, Alwyn was already a character year, so in the comic, right? Let's do Alto. Or Alto. Alto is a good name for a bard. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Healing serenade all the way. Healing serenade it is. How did I meet Thanor? Um, we'll be heroic. We'll be a heroic bard. It was a dark and stormy night. This LARP thing just might work. All right. Awesome sauce. Uh, so is that it? Are we done here? Another drinking bird. Gotcha. Okay. Drums. Okay. Um, can I talk to Steph again, or are we good? It's sweet. She's planning a whole lark for Ethan. All right. Let's get out of here. just want to be friends. No? Well, shit. <laughs> Gabe was hoping I'd get back into playing. Maybe I will. All right, let's go find Mac. I'm just saying he better not fuck with me. He knows I can turn his face into hamburger meat. Like, don't try me. Do not try me. Yeah, how are you guys? How's life? How are things? Um, I'm fine. I'm just stressed. Just always stressed. <laughs> just my new way of being. I probably will be for the next few months nonstop. So let's, here's hoping I don't get high blood pressure or an ulcer or anything like that. Cause I still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Can't afford it. Hmm, I wonder what Steph's working on. It looks cool. I should DM her to find out more and see how I can help. This doesn't happen to have anything to do with your latest post, does it? Last post. Shoot, if only there was some way to find out. Whatever it is, looks like it's gonna be shocking. You hush. <laughs> Love it. Okay, I'm excited. Okay, where's the flower shop? It's over here, right? I think? No. Or maybe. Still haven't found Mac. Jed suggested I check the flower shop. Yeah, I'm trying to remember where the hell the flower Too shop bad. is. I can't just run away from all this. Oh. Well, because I thought it was... Maybe it's on the other side of the street. Maybe. Okay, avalanche ice cream. Oh. Wait. Haven drugs. Bait and tackle. Well, I thought it was... Further that way from the dispensary. Oh, well, you're fine. It's not your fault. Oh. <laughs> Looks I like would. thanks, I guess. Man, these overnight shifts really take it out. Yeah. I think the trails will be closed. For okay, a while. hold on. Do I have like a map of this place? Oh my god, what stuff? Hey, saw what you did with the LARP. Thank you so much. Of course, I think Ethan's gonna love it. I think you're right. Where the hell's... where the hell am I? Wild. Someone died up in the ravine a few so days yeah, ago. Yeah, it's the record store. Silver Dragon. Well, we can try 
picks up this dude. Lantern. Where the fuck is the flower shop? I'm so lost. Wind chime. I like wind chimes. Wind chimes. The original jam band. True. True. Okay. Silver dragon, drugstore. Bait and tackle. Wait, maybe. Oh, flower shop. Good God. <laughs> it was hidden, okay? I couldn't see it. I don't think there was a sign. I didn't see a sign. It's not my fault. Ugh. Second video of the day, and my body's already hating me. It's gonna be a long one, that's for sure. Almost as long as these loading screens. <laughs> like, are we in the point of technology now where loading screens shouldn't take this long? Eleanor? Oh! <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? Oh. I'm, um... Still just trying to adjust, I think. Give yourself some time. Change is always hard. Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Thanks. Now, what was I? She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. What the fuck? Why is it not letting me read her mind? That must have been a different time. Oh, there we go. Okay, time to figure out why she's afraid. Oh, my memories, oh, my memories are, fading. are fading. I feel, I feel broken. broken. Well, damn. Okay. Ooh, I hope she doesn't have like dementia or some shit. The doctor said the doctor I had, said more, I time, had more time, but. Everything is becoming, becoming so, so out, of, out order. of order. That might be exactly what this is. How does she hide all of this? Okay. Let's see. There's some stuff back here. If Riley, if Riley finds, finds out. out. She can't, she can't find out. Find out. be missing something. Um, 
Oh. Duh. If they know if they about know my about condition, my they'll make me close this place. just that she forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. But how can I help her? Yeah, bitch is going through it. Forget what you were working on? <sighs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Oh, uh, I don't want to keep you. <laughs> hey. I... I want to help. Okay. Okay. What would Eleanor have done first? Um... Well... I don't know. Why is it out of or- Oh, I don't like that. I imagine she... I don't know, that's really hard. Um, okay, I would assume that she would do the sign first. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in, and then I open my mail. Something must have distracted me. Maybe like the phone ringing? Better. We can do this. Okay. So she flipped the sign, she read her mail, she said she got distracted. I'm assuming that was from the phone. Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. But I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. Maybe, hmm, maybe the register. Ooh, or maybe this, maybe. Did you trim these flowers today? I don't remember. Okay, I'll check the register next. Oh, it can't be the register? Oh, the maybe... the picture? Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Oh, goodness. What was the order for? There we go. That's what it was. That's... that's what's next. Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. 
So we'll check the receipt in the cash register. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. It should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan, huh. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Seriously, Alex, you're a godsend. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. God. She doesn't remember. You know Jed. Probably doesn't know the difference between a lily and a tulip. <laughs> <laughs> Don't sell him short. He's more clever than he seems. That might not have been the right choice, but I don't regret it. All right, well, on that note... Thanks again for your help. Don't be a stranger. Yeah, okay. On that note, oh, we're going to go ahead and... Promise. She was finally feeling better. I didn't want to ruin that. What do you want? You want to make fun of me, too, like those other jock assholes? What? No. I... You made a sick killer robot and won a fucking contest. That's... First of all, we got third place. And anyway, he's not a robot. Technically, he's... Ugh. God. Way to take the bait, right? Okay. Uh, yeah, on that note, we're going to go ahead and end this episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share this with your friends, hit the bell so you don't miss an upload, and I'll see you guys next time. But I can't cry.